Hey guys, so it's about 6.20. I got up about five minutes ago. I didn't get the best sleep, but I got some, so that's something. And I'm just gonna get uh, ready to get out the door. Hey, so I just got to work. For those of you that don't know, I commute from Staten Island to Brooklyn. The commute took about 15 minutes, which isn't terrible. Uh, but if there was no traffic, it would take me about 25 to 30 minutes. So, um, it was hectic. It's a, you know, it's the first day back is always hard. I feel like the first week back is going to be hard for me in terms of driving. And I deleted a clip. I, I took one from, there was one between this one and the one from this morning. And I don't know what happened. I deleted it for some reason. Uh, I was delete happy so I uh, it was just me saying that I left 10 minutes later than I wanted to which is okay um, it's not today and tomorrow there's no children the first day that the children come back uh, for New York public schools is on Thursday today and tomorrow for educators teachers paras we're just setting up the classroom and I was saying that I don't know who I'm where I'm going to be working like what grade and who with last year they sent out an email uh, saying who you're gonna be with but this year they didn't I don't know if that's because the principal had a baby this summer uh, although there are two other assistant principals at my school uh, but I got here waiting for a spot to open up and I want to show you my breakfast so I have my coffee that I make the night before because it just saves me a little bit more time and green tea pills they have caffeine in them so i take that in the morning it's supposed to help with weight loss and that's a, i was struggling this morning i was late because i have picked out an outfit the night before and i did not like it so i was like doing like multiple outfit changes and i'm like i gotta go uh so i also brought brown cow and i thought this was maple syrup i'm so bummed out this is vanilla it's okay but maple syrup is the best and then I have a scone and I put some butter and strawberry jam and then a clementine. I don't know if I'm going to eat all this. I just brought it, of course, a spoon. I brought it just in case I felt hungry and I'm going to put some more makeup on. Uh, I, already, I just put a layer. That's another reason I was late. I put a layer of foundation on and I did that. Wayne Goss trick where you mix your foundation with your setting spray and I just put it like around this area and under my eyes just for an extra uh, layer of uh, foundation coverage uh, to last me all day so yeah that's what's going on I just finished my makeup and this is a little more than I usually do I added eyeliner which I normally don't um, but I figured why not and I was getting a little mascara that fell down. So this is basic makeup that I do in the car uh, when I come to work. And then I'm even going to put some lipstick on. This is the Wet n Wild Mega Last Liquid Cat Suit in Rebel Rose. And I love this shade. This is my go-to shade and probably my favorite lipstick, actually. Um, let me just show you quickly what it looks like. And I do, so I put this on, I blot it, and then I put another layer on, and it seems to stay for a little bit longer. Just a very pretty everyday color. I'm still waiting for a spot to open up, which kind of sucks, but that's just the way it goes coming here. Parking is pretty tough in Brooklyn. Okay, I thought I would share with you. So I brought these shoes uh, to leave in the car. Uh, they're they're the Adidas Super Super Boost Ultra Boost. I love them, but my favorite pair have holes in them and everything. And uh, I'm just so comfortable with driving with those that I am wearing those right now to drive. But then I'll change into actually these sandals, and I'll leave the sneakers in the car. So I have like four pairs of shoes in this car and that's how it gets it. By the end of the year, I'm bringing in like a whole wardrobe. And I think I'm gonna leave my extra clothes in here. Uh, I brought like leggings, a t-shirt, just in case somebody ever throws up on me, which does happen from time to time. It happened last year where this little girl threw up on my bottom of my pants and shoes. So that was just wow. <laughs> but yeah, I am that's I've just got to wait around for a spot to open up 
Hey guys, so I'm walking to the main building. I found a spot finally, somebody pulled out. And I just wanted to show you a couple of my favorite places. Can't really tell, but that place right there has amazing Mexican food. It's so good. We usually have our end of the year party there. Bakery, Mazolas. That's really, really good. Um, and it's just beautiful here. The area I work in is Carroll Gardens, and you can kind of see why. I walk over to the annex. I assume I'm gonna be at this location and I'll explain a little bit more about the annex later why I'm at a different location in the main school. But here is everything before we set up. It's easier to show you because no kids names or faces are on here. Ah, so nice. Get to start over and I just want to show you up there. Skylight, you can't open it though, which is a bummer. And the custodian did not. Put the air on which i don't understand it's 77 degrees in here oh and there's a bathroom each classroom has one there's two classrooms here and i, I guess i could tell you about the annex now hey so uh the annex the main school which is at a different location 10 minutes away by walk we um they outgrew the space and they moved two pre-k classes here and I was asked if I wanted to come and a lot of people don't want to move from the big school to here because you're not in the loop and you're far away from everybody. There's a very small staff here, about six or seven people. And I chose to come because I needed a job and I took it and I'm so happy I did. I do better in a smaller space and I just, um, I think I'm gonna be here. Nobody officially said it, but uh, when I asked if I could come down here, they were like, yeah, of course, administration. So happy about that. I thought I would do outfit of the day. It's so hard to do it in this small mirror, but I'm wearing this top from Nordstrom Rack. And then there's an undershirt underneath because I'm sweating. <laughs> that is from Uniqlo, that undershirt that I love, the Arism. Here are jeans from Macy's Down Co. And I just folded uh, the bottom and then my Old Navy flats. Here is my cubby on the right. And I'm gonna rearrange that. I guess first, let me get this situated and then I will work on the classroom. And the teacher is on her way, so probably not gonna do much filming after this in here anyway. Just to catch you up of what I'm doing, it's around 11.30 and I am taking, so at the end of the year, we put these toys into plastic bags just to keep dust out and if any rodents, which I don't think we have. Um, and we'll reuse these bags throughout the year. And then I tidied up the kitchen area a little bit because this is where I work a lot. And nobody told me my hair looked like this. <laughs> so I'm gonna fix that and get started but just been organizing and getting the classroom set up we just finished lunch i had calexico and it's so good there good mexican food i had beet taco and then right now i'm going to start on this project we are getting rid of those because they are worn and torn and we are going to do rainbow choice cards and choice cards are just activities for kids to choose from. I just got home. It is four o'clock, so it took me about an hour to get home, which is kind of not that great, but it's not terrible either. And my neighbor, as soon as I parked the car, I couldn't park in the front of the house. Somebody else parked there, which I expected. As soon as I parked the car, she's out there. And she's pretending to do stuff, but she's not and she's lovely but it's also I don't want to talk right now so we'll see what happens I thought I would end the vlog here I hope you guys enjoyed watching 
uh, my first day back at work and it was I'm exhausted now but it was a great day and it's so nice to just have this time to organize and set up the classroom I I believe I'm back at the same place I've been for the last three years but we get official word tomorrow so wish me luck if you have any questions or comments let me know and I'll try to get back to you and I'll talk to you guys later bye